Good morning, Faux Fam, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on those posts and notifications. Today is February 25th, 2020, which means tomorrow I turn 19. I don't even have hair ties in my braids. That's how much of a mess I am right now. My sleep schedule has been so whack lately. I've been staying up to like 3 a.m. and sleeping until noon. It's so bad. So I figured what a better time than like the day before my birthday to do a transformation video, a glow up. So today, I'm gonna be doing exactly that. Not only do I wanna glow up for my birthday tomorrow, but I have my mom's wedding coming up in about a week, and then it's spring, so I figured this is just like a really good time to kind of try to get my life together. So I started, I didn't vlog yet, but I woke up at 9.30 this morning, which is way early for me because I've been waking up at noon, so I'm really proud, and we're already off to a great start. Whenever I do transformation videos, I like to try to do not just physical things, but like things that'll help me mentally as well. So I'm gonna start this morning by doing a little workout. I do the Chloe Ting program. I'm doing the two-week shred program right now. If you guys watch her, you know how good her workouts are. So let's just get started. Well, first I gotta make my bed because it's stressing me out. workout was intense I am really tired but it is time to make breakfast so I'm gonna make smoothie bowls for me and Dallas and I was gonna wait to the end of the video to show you guys the new merch but I have officially come out with my Sydney Forsyth merch and here it is let me just do a little fashion show for you so we have it in hoodies crew necks short sleeves and long sleeves so we've got SF it's kind of like the OG merch that said SM, but I wanted to make it a little bit more cool. And then the back, I am obsessed. And it comes in a bunch of different colors. And I decided that like every season, I'll kind of change up the colors. If you want to get your merch, sydneyforsyth.com. So I always use all of my frozen fruits, frozen pineapples, frozen strawberries, frozen blueberries. Also going to need some fresh fruit for the top of the smoothies. I'll need some granola. Last but not least, some honey. Oh wait, actually I also need almond milk. I don't really have like a set like measurement of anything. I just do like what feels right. So let's just make them. on my glow up list is to pamper myself in the shower slash bath and like exfoliate, shave my legs, just like, you know, make myself feel really nice and fresh and pampered. Self care, you know? Um, I took my hair out of the braids and I kind of like this look. My hair is never like this. So I'm gonna put it in a bun so I don't get it wet. So before I hop in the shower, and I'm showering in my guest shower because my master bathroom shower is really small and this one has a bath so then I can like shower and then take a bath. But I want to show you my shower products. So to shave my legs, I use this Billy Razor. They come in so many cute colors and it's like a subscription so they send you like new heads. The head is removable. I used to use coconut oil to shave my legs. I don't really do that as much. It does dull the razor head. I still do it sometimes though because it makes your legs really soft or I might just moisturize with it. Recently, I have been using this as my shave cream. Um, <laughs> My cousin got it for me for like my honeymoon, you know, but I use it to shave my legs and it's actually the best shaving cream I have ever used. So 
Yes. <laughs> and then to exfoliate, I use this um, exfoliator. Oh, Frank Body, that's the brand. My favorite body wash is the Bath & Body Works wash in the scent Rose. Rose is my favorite scent. I literally have two of the body washes, a bunch of the rose perfume and lotion. So. And then if I were to wash my hair, I use uh, Function of Beauty. And I'm also going to extra paper myself and put on a clay mask. This is from Hello Body. It's called Coco Wow. All right, let's get the shower cranking. The best shower ever i am so soft and silky right now my face is soft my legs are soft everything about me is so soft so we're actually gonna go get my nails done first and don's gonna go with me because he's such a good husband i really didn't want to go by myself i'm probably just gonna get like a light gray because i also need these nails for my mom's wedding and her colors are navy so i can't get black nails so i'm gonna keep it simple i changed into just like a jacket and a t-shirt so when i go to the mall and try on outfits it doesn't take forever to take off my hoodie and put on my hoodie so here we go let's go get my nails done getting my nails done they look so good I was going for a gray and then I decided I wanted to get this like purpley gray it's a little more purple than I thought but I still think it looks really good and like matches me really well and I decided to get them pretty short I did get tips added on but normally I get them super long and I've been so annoyed by that lately so this is perfect Supposed to be my birthday shopping and Don got himself something, but that's fine. I want you to be cute. Spending all day days with me. Shopping. Days? Yeah. What? S felt like days. <laughs> okay, we got our outfits from Target and we just stopped by Sally's. I didn't vlog it just because it was a quick in and out. Um, my cousin Ellie had told me about these earrings because I have really sensitive ears and these are like hypoallergenic hoops, but I always struggle with hoops because they either hurt to lay on because they have like the back or they get stuck in my ears because there's not like a clasp, but these ones are like perfect because they like click together. I did my makeup in my last video. I literally did like a full on, this is my everyday makeup, catch up with me. So if you guys want to see my makeup routine, you can go watch my last video, but I'm not gonna like do that whole shebang for the video right now. You go watch my beauty blender. So if you guys watched my last video, I know I said the next video will be my birthday vlog, but realistically, I wouldn't have enough time to edit it, so that's why I'm posting this, but my next video will definitely be my birthday vlog. So to be honest, I don't really know what I want to do like during the day for my birthday. I don't, my, don't have any friends that are just hanging out with Dallin, but I do that every day, so it's also gonna be 33 and snowing, possibly snow. That also limits my options, which is weird because the last like three years, it's randomly just been like 70 degrees on my birthday. Ooh, new person. Who this? Okay, to be honest, let me know what you guys think about the eyeliner. I feel like I messed up a little bit, but I'm getting better every time. So that's what matters. And so this is what the earrings look like. They're just cute little hoops. Um, see how the earring, like that would not be comfortable to sleep on. So the new ones are just hoops that clip and hopefully my ears enjoy them as well. Okay, I need to like re-stab the hole in my ear. Boom, got that one, click. <gasps> Yay, look at that. Oh, it's such a cute little hoop. Second one. See, hopefully my ears will enjoy these and I will be comfortable enough to sleep in them and then I'll just never have to take them out. This is hopefully is the only time I have to put them in. Where is the exit hole? Okay, about six and a half years later, I got it in, got this one in. This one was a pain as well. So, I did it. Now time to try and die, basically. Now I'm gonna see if I can get my cartilage piercing back. I have done this before, it was painful. So here we go. Let's see if I can even see where the hole is. Okay, wait, there might not even be a hole anymore. <laughs> they get completely healed. Oh, that's not happening. 
I'm going to curl my hair because I didn't realize my outfit is kind of like 80s, 90s vibes. And my hair was just looking like straight out of the 80s and I wasn't about it. So I'm going to curl it. So this is what it looks like right now. Final reveal. Here we go. Three, two, one. Today's outfit, it, everything is from Target except I'm wearing Doc Martens. Just got these cute mom jeans. I like don't own any belts, so this is kind of fun to have a belt. I feel so stylish. And then I love the like a rustic vibe of this shirt. Ready to see it? Close your eyes until you walk in the door. Where is everything? Okay. Right there. Okay, look. Oh, that's look, look, Aww, you look so cute. Really? Yeah. Yay. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. And this is all mine. Uh, Sucks to be you guys. I had to curl my hair because do you see how it's kind of like an 80s, 90s outfit? No, I love it. Yeah. I do too, but the hair was like straight out of the 80s, so I had to switch up my hair. Yes, babe. Yay. <laughs> so cute. These jeans are so comfy. And from Target, they're literally only twenty dollars. Like, so in conclusion of this video, I feel so much more confident. I feel like I look a little older. Like I'm more ready to, you know, turn nineteen, the like most awkward birthday because you're still a teenager, but you are an adult, but you're not an adult, but you are. I'm about to be nineteen, and by the time this video is posted, I am nineteen because my birthday was on February twenty-sixth. I'll do this video not only for content and for glowing up for my birthday, but also because I've been feeling kind of down and a little bit, not insecure, but just like not as confident. And I feel like none of my outfits really looked that great on me. And I just, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling fully myself. And not only did I do this to do it for fun, but also to boost my confidence because whenever you dress cute and put forth effort and actually try, then that's you telling your mind like, I love you and I'm trying my best for you. So I do feel a lot more confident right now. Obviously having new outfits is always great, but you don't have to do that to do a little glow up. And if you are looking to buy something new, you can always shop my merch, sydneyforsyth.com down below. I can't wait for it to be a little warmer outside so I can wear the short sleeve more, but I love the new merch and I'm so excited about it. I actually came up with the design all by myself and it took me forever to come up with because you guys kept saying you wanted stuff like the old merch and I just didn't know what to do because I couldn't find the like PDF file for the old merch otherwise I would have just like redone it but then I was like kind of want to do something new. So it's similar enough that I feel like you guys will like it but different enough that it feels like it made me. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope it was enjoyable and maybe gave you some inspiration on like how to get ready for spring or just like boost your confidence a little bit. Um, if you guys did enjoy this video, give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what other kind of videos you want to see in the description. And if you have not yet, it would mean the world to me if you could hit that subscribe button and maybe even share this video with a friend for my birthday maybe. Okay, I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next one.